The new Mercedes S550 is a brilliant machine. Here are some of the things you probably didn't know about it, however. First off, Mercedes claims that this is the first car ever to have no incandescent light bulbs in the car whatsoever. That means 56 LEDs in the headlights, 35 in the taillights, and over 300 in the interior. The S550 has two massive 12.3 inch high res screens. But what you might not know is that this has a really cool feature, the optional split view entertainment. I can be looking at the navigation and because my angle of attack for my eyesight is this way and the passengers is this way, I can be looking at navigation while the passenger watches a movie at the same time on the same screen. How's that for high tech? Now of course the S-Class is not a driver's car, but the seats are very cool. When you go around a turn, it's got automatic bolsters that inflate on one side or the other to counteract the G-forces of going around a turn. So it really keeps you in place like nice bucket seats, but when they deflate, comfortable as ever. The S-Class is absolutely massive. It's 198 inches long, but Mercedes worked very hard at making the turning radius as small as possible. I swear, maneuvering this car in tight spots, making U-turns is incredibly easy, especially for a car of this size. Very impressed with the turning radius. One of the coolest features of the S-Class is that it legitimately can drive itself. I don't have my hands on the steering wheel right now. It's got active lane keep assist and adaptive cruise control. It is tracking the car in front of me and also monitoring the white lines on either side to keep me in the middle of the lane. This can actually go around turns as well. Obviously, it's not a perfect system. It's a little bit scary, but one step further towards fully autonomous vehicles. Well, I hope you found this video informative. Like always, please browse our channel and subscribe. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram. Look forward to seeing you next video.